morning everyone it is Friday morning and I want to eat something kind of savory and warm um, so I'm gonna make this little stew and it is the quickest easiest actually low calorie filling um, stew type thing I just kind of made it up one day it's kind of I kind of a rendition between like spaghetti or um, a chili or it's just it is what it is but it is so easy um, it is literally a dump and go kind of thing and I've got somebody trying to get my attention just ignore that but um, it's like dump and go let it simmer for a while just so everything gets all you know um, cohesive and then yeah and I'll show you the numbers and stuff because um, I did I worked out some of the numbers but it's gonna be somewhere like 130 calories for um, a cup and yeah it's just amazing so if you could imagine 260 for two cups so I'm gonna let you see it and then I'm gonna make I'm gonna let you see the ingredients here then I'm gonna make it in the pot and then we'll show it to you when it's done so check this out all right you guys so this is a, a vegetarian meal okay and yes there is going to be a lot of sodium in here so just get prepared for that but um so what we've got we've got our veggie griller crumbler crumbles these uh, to me are very good they're vegetarian but you could use um, lean ground beef here as well so I'm gonna put that in there I'm gonna drain a whole can of corn I'm gonna drain and put in the diced potatoes I'm going to drain and put in some black beans sometimes I even put in white beans as well if I have it in this case I was gonna use I usually use like can of rotel but you can use whatever you want and make it however which way you want but I happen to have like half a jar of this um, um, you know marinara sauce here and so I'm gonna put that in there um, I'm going to use um, some chopped onion flakes because that's what I've got and it's easy some garlic and then just for the spice what I love and also to give me a little bit of that tomato and it's also like helping me clean out my refrigerator is a jar of salsa so I only have about half a jar of my favorite salsa this right here is five calories for two tablespoons so there and they're gonna go all in this pot right here I'm gonna put the lid on it let it get warm these are frozen right now this is cold this is cold so I mean it doesn't have to no, everything is already cooked so you're just trying to warm it up and get the flavors to kind of melt together so let's get this started We just stir stir it all together and just let it warm up on the stove for as long as you want it to so I'm gonna finish stirring this and then I'll show it to you again in a sec okay so this is it I have stirred it up it's on about medium-high heat I'm gonna let it go until it starts to bubble then I'm gonna put the top on it and reduce it down to low and just let it sit so um, this is honestly what it's going to look like when it's done, but um, I just wanted to share that little very fulfilling recipe since it's just on the cusp of being fall and cooler weather. So just for those of you that are, you can serve this over rice if you want like extra carbs. <laughs> you can eat by itself. You can eat it over bread. I mean, lots of ways to eat it. But anyway, super yum. All right, you guys, this is starting to um, 
starting to boil, so I went ahead and put the top on it. And I mentioned rice and bread and all that, and, but you know, um, I wouldn't be doing it justice if I didn't give you a lower carb weight or a lower um, calorie weight, and that is to put it on zoodles maybe, or collie rice, and, but I am going to be eating it by itself. It is very fulfilling. Sorry, I had a very long and rough night and morning already, um, but uh, yeah, so I'm looking forward to having something delicious in my belly, and uh, so I'm going to take you to my office and we're going to go over some numbers so we can see exactly how many calories is in a serving, because I think you're going to be really surprised. I'm going to say it's like, it's going to be less than 130, and uh, sorry for the lighting, because I'm moving around, but about less than 130. So let's go look. There we go, guys. This is this is the calories in everything that I added. That's the corn, the potatoes, the meatless um, crumbles, the uh, black beans, the everything except the only thing that's not in here is the salsa. And honestly, I mean, if I added sixty to this, that would be over honestly so I mean you're looking at like approximately so I'm gonna say 130 calories per serving uh, and I'm that that pot is full so I'm saying there's 10 servings in there and um, so one 10 one cup servings um, so you can easily say that even if you wanted to round up just to be safe to one or two, even 200 I mean that is um, very very fulfilling and delicious meal. Oh my, I just tasted it and it is spot on. And I haven't even added any pepper yet. I haven't added any more salt because the salt's already in the marinara sauce and some, you know, the corn and the potatoes and, you know, beans, that kind of thing. But it is really delicious. Oh, and salsa. But it is deliciously seasoned. So I'm so excited to eat it and I hope you guys... You guys have a very blessed day and a wonderful day and um yeah so enjoy this meal happy almost fall i guess um yeah so we'll see you next week i'm still working on my damn diet so <laughs> bye for now